It's our other big story at 6. Contaminated water is a problem for more homes than originally thought after DNR officials find high levels of vinyl chloride in people's drinking water in Mantua County. Today they hosted a special open house to help people understand what's going on and if they're at risk. NBC 26's Raquel Lamel joins us live with more. Holly, close to 100 people showing up for today's open house, many with just one question on their mind. Is my water contaminated? Today, they got their answers. Inside the Newton Town Hall, Would you rather have a well or get picked up to the city? A packed room, people waiting to know what's going on with their wells. We've sampled over 100 houses at this point. Of those 100 houses, 15 of them um, have had detects in exceedance of the DNR drinking water standards. The contamination, a result of the city allowing a gravel pit in the town of Newton to be a toxic waste dumping site for the area businesses back in the 60s and 70s. That practice discontinued later, but now homeowners like Jerry Hout paying the price. It is unacceptable at this point for to use our water for cooking or drinking. The city of Manitowoc providing bottled water to the Hout family while they continue testing the water, but Hout says he worries about what health problems could haunt him and his family in the future. I, I don't know if it's been contaminated from that point on since we've lived here. City officials say the side effects of the contaminated water would take a long time to cause damage, adding they don't believe anyone is facing health risks at this point. In order to have an increased chance of having health problems, you'd have to consume something like two gallons of the water every day for 70 years. The waste dumping site sits just west of Hecker Road and is impacting homes along the street as well as County Highway CR flowing southeast. It has gotten down into bedrock and once it gets to bedrock the, the travel times for these contaminants within groundwater is very um, very hard to determine. The DNR is providing clean drinking water to homeowners. Six of the contaminated houses have had new wells installed, and the DNR is working on solutions for the other nine homes. The level of contamination varies depending on where you live, and if you have questions or would like your water tested, you're asked to call the city of Manitowoc or the DNR. Raquel Amell, NBC 26.